welcome to Aspire to Wellbeing's 21 Day Yoga Challenge designed to help you develop a yoga practice as a habit. This 21 day challenge is aimed at the beginner yogi as well as those that are time poor with short and educational videos. You will develop a solid technique as well as learn the fundamentals of yoga. It takes 21 days to form a habit so it is my hope that after this 21 days, yoga will be a regular part of your life. If you have just randomly come across this video and would like to participate in the 21 day challenge, I've popped all of the details to that in the description. Before we begin the daily video today, if you have not already warmed up, I've created a short warm up for you and the link to that is in the description box as well. Welcome to day 18. Today's video is a technique tutorial teaching you boat pose. This is a challenging pose and we'll be getting plenty of practice building that core strength at the end. I will see you in the class. With your legs straight in front of you, sitting on the floor, bring your hands a little behind you next to your hips. Lean back slightly, lifting the top of your sternum. Make sure your back stays nice and straight. And then balance your weight on your sitting bones and tailbone. As you exhale, bend your knees. Lift your thighs so they're about 45 degrees above the floor with your knees still bent. If you can, you can start to straighten your knees raising the tips of your toes slightly over the level of your eyes. If that's not possible, just keep your knees bent with your shins parallel to the floor. Draw your shoulders down your back and extend both arms forward alongside the legs, parallel to the floor with your palms facing in. And try to keep the heart open, shoulders rolled back in their sockets and a nice straight spine. Tips and modifications. If it's too challenging to raise your arms, just keep your hands on the floor besides your hips, or you could hold the back of your thighs. If you can't straighten your legs, then just keep the knees bent. You could even take a strap and loop it around the soles of your feet. Boat pose, or otherwise known as Navasana in Sanskrit. So this pose strengthens the core, the thighs. It also helps to counteract your desk posture or prolonged sitting. It can boost your energy levels and help build focus and body awareness. If you start to feel your upper back slouch or any strain in the lower back, modify the pose or come down and reset with a long spine. There is no point pushing through the pose if you're feeling this in your lower back. Congratulations on completing another day of the 21 day yoga challenge. Don't forget to like and comment on each daily video, letting me know you've completed the day of the challenge and letting me know how you went to stay in the running for the monthly prize draw, where each month one lucky subscriber will win a one hour private yoga session with me. T's and C's for this competition are in the description box below. Enjoy the rest of your day and I will see you tomorrow.